Hi, thanks, Lori. My name is Craig Sandvig. I'm the Digital Product Design Manager. I've had the great pleasure of working on every generation Mustang since I started at Ford, starting with the SN95. Everything from exterior and interior to components, culminating to the 2018 first fully reconfigurable cluster. And that's where we'll start the journey. So if you want to step around, hopefully find some shade, but we're going to show some stuff in the vehicle. So much like the 2018, we have this 13.2 center stack and a 12.4 cluster. And this is where we created these little micro environments for shifting between the different modes. So we have these little different animations that capture what each drive mode does. I'll just keep playing with that. And this whole experience really comes to life when you're in the driver's seat. So I can't wait to get you guys in this. Um, and then we also introduced something called custom, which I'll touch on in a little bit. But now we go back to the center stack again. This is under one piece of glass, so it's seamless between cluster and center stack. But we're taking the SYNC 4 hardware, similar to what you find on other Ford products. We've skinned it to be Mustang specific. So now the look, again, is seamless. It's a dark palette only, so it helps aid in that seamless structure between the, the cluster and the center stack. So now for this generation Mustang, we have something called My Mustang. So we won't go over any of the sync features. This is really where it comes to life and embraces that whole customization aspect. And this is where we're actually using Unreal Gaming technology to actually render out this car real time. And this is a feature where you can swipe the car and rotate it. It's just something fun and innovative that we've never done in a car. People are used to doing that with the games, with your tablets, with your phones. We're bringing that into the car. Um, we've also brought all the track apps that used to be in the cluster, utilizing this 13.2 touchscreen into the track apps. So we have, again, the vehicles. You can do all the same acceleration timer, brake performance, set up your line lock. There's seamless communication between the cluster and the center stack. And again, similar to what Chris was talking about Easter eggs, we have Easter eggs throughout this experience. One of them is the icon for track apps is actually inspired by Groton Raceway in Michigan where a lot of the development has happened. So those are the little details that we know our customers really appreciate. We also brought over all of the aux gauges. So now again, we're utilizing the center stack. You can pick between a five gauge layout and a three gauge layout, and you can adjust the order either by just pressing and holding, again, similar to what everyone's used to with your tablets and phones, or, you can sit there and use the setting buttons. So we're given, again, different options, different customizations. And that all culminates into what we're calling custom mode. So now we have six different profiles that you can choose from. You can set it up between your different base drive modes, different steering options, trash control options, even down to auto start stop, and even the cluster themes. So if you want to drive around in your profile with normal, you can, or you can switch it to Calm, Sport, Track, or even our Fox Body theme. We also have brought over my color that used to just be in the cluster. Now it's embraced across the cluster and the center stack, and it's a much more intuitive experience. So if you wanted to change your primary and secondary color, it's as simple as that. And that's, again, affecting both commodities. And again, we have introduced our normal sport and track, which people have today, we're also bringing in something called Calm View. So if you want a little bit of that digital detox, you can have it now. But my personal favorite is the Fox Body theme. And that not only shows the daytime palette, but at nighttime, it also shows that iconic Ford green color. Uh, obviously it's a little too bright here, but again, it's just something that we really resonated with the customers talking to them Fox bodies are really popular, much like Lori growing up, everybody wanted a Mustang five liter notchback. So that really hits home for somebody like myself. So again, everything is nice, simple, and intuitive. We have this persistent climate control always at the bottom. And then again, in this lower button bank, we have quick action keys to get to my Mustang. So all the normal sync features, plus a lot more with the my Mustang. And again, thanks to the sync system, we have over there update capabilities. And again, Unreal is just scratching the surface of what we can do with this uh, technology.